Hey, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. Welcome back to Star Citizen. So as always, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for joining me for another Star Citizen video. And you guys might be wondering, Spectre, what the hell are you doing inside a nomad? Well, guys, allow me to explain. Allow me to explain. So it's been a while since I've done a proper Star Citizen video. Let's get this thing started. And here we are on Microtech. So guys, I'm back in Microtech. I'm back in Microtech. I lived on Hurston for a short while. Then I, 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 I thought to myself, I love the snow a little bit too much. I love the cold weather, especially the night times. I miss the snow too much. So here I am. I'm, I'm, I'm back on Microtech again. But this video isn't about Microtech. This video isn't about the Nomad. This video is about the Hover Quad Bike from Consolidated Outland. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, so this is the newest vehicle to be released into Star Citizen. And if you guys like short videos, well, should you buy this thing? No. No, I, I absolutely shouldn't buy this thing. So, thank you so much for watching the video. That's about it, ladies and gentlemen. I'll see you guys next time. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I, I am kidding, ladies and gentlemen. I'm kidding. So, this thing is a hover bike. Yeah, it's a hover bike from Consolidated Outland. And yeah, let's go ahead and take it out for a spin. Let's take it out for a spin. So this thing is currently priced at $25 war bond or $30 for in-store credit. So yeah. So what's so special about hover bikes now? Well, the thing is that hover bikes got a complete rework, complete flight model uh, rework with patch 3.16. So this thing, the Dragonfly, the Nox, these guys all got a rework of how they fly. So they fly a lot better now. Before, it was actually quite dangerous to fly in one of these things. It would flip over, it would go crazy. Pretty much what they've changed is that when you get on the bike, now you can set the right height. And the ship's flight computer, or I should say the bike's flight computer, will hold that height as best as it can. So you can, you can, you can set the height like that. And the paint that you see on this isn't uh, the paint that comes with the bike. This is this is an extra paint that I've bought. Uh, yeah, so this is the new hover bike. Check it out. It was supposed to come with the Nomad. So when the Nomad released two years ago, this thing was supposed to come with the Nomad. And for whatever reason, they delayed it till now. So yeah, here is the hover bike. So let me just go ahead and show you guys something. Let me just go ahead and get off. Okay, so this thing doesn't have a gun. This thing, unlike the, uh, the, the dragonflies, this thing doesn't have a gun and it doesn't have a shield. So check this out. Look at this cool button. Yeah, that's the cooler. So that, that way you can access the cooler. So this thing, can, this thing only has a cooler and a power plant and that's it. No shields, no guns, and nothing. And here's the power plant right here. Should be there somewhere. <laughs> ah, there it is. It was right here. I was looking at the wrong place. There it is. It's right there. Okay, so this thing doesn't have a gun, which is something that I, I, I like. I want to see more vehicles, more ships in Star Citizen, which, which aren't armed, right? I, I like to see more civilian ships, more civilian vehicles. This thing is like a snowmobile. It looks great. It's very stable. Like you can see how the uh, the four legs kind of spread out. This thing is very stable. It flies really fast. And also this thing has a storage box. So just check it out. So this thing has enough storage space for 125,000 micro SCU. I'm not sure what that is. So you can compare it with the capacity on the uh, on the suit and you can see it's quite a lot. It's quite a lot. So this thing isn't is armed, and, and I like it. <laughs> to be honest, this thing is better when it's not armed. We need more civilian vehicles in Star Citizen. So hover bikes, how do they fly in general? They fly quite fast. This thing is quite fast as well. Just check this out. This thing is blisteringly fast. Check it out. This thing is crazy fast. Three kilometers. 
<laughs> we went three kilometers in that short distance. So the maximum speed... Wow, that sounds good. Maximum speed is 200 meters per second. And it stops quick. It's really nimble. It's really, really nimble. And one of the changes that they did with the hover bikes is, is, is in the way that they turn. So if we just slow it down a little bit, you can see how stable it is in the turn. Very, very stable in the turn. It wasn't like that before. Oh, and by the way, check out this amazing view. Check out this awesome nighttime view on this frozen lake on Microtech. This is the reason why I love Microtech, guys. <laughs> so yeah, this is the new hover bike. Who should buy this thing? Well, you shouldn't buy this thing just to own a hover bike because this thing will be very very easily attainable in game it'll be very very cheap you could probably buy this thing very very quickly in game so you should buy this thing if you're looking for a ccu token and what do i mean by that so this thing currently is uh because it's new this thing has lti lifetime insurance so if you buy this thing and then upgrade this to another ship that you want that doesn't have LTI, the LTI from this will carry over to the next ship. So let's just say you're interested in a Sabre. Sabres no longer no longer come with, they no longer come with LTI. And if you upgrade this thing to a Sabre, well your Sabre now has LTI. So if you if you wanted to use this thing as a CCU upgrade, then yeah you should buy this. Otherwise it's not really worth it. This thing the, the, the acceleration on the hover bike seems to be a little too quick. They seem to be a little too too jerky, a little bit too jittery. So let's go ahead and park it. Whoop. And there we go. And lower it down. Engines off, power off. That sounds great. There you go. That sounded awesome. That sounded awesome. So yeah, ladies and gentlemen, this is the Consolidated Outland Hover Quad Bike. And my character's freezing. <laughs> really, really cool. You guys can hear the shivers. There you go. So yeah, this is the... Cons <laughs> <laughs> all right whatever that was it just broke guys it just broke <laughs> yeah ladies and gentlemen thank you so much for watching uh, this first look at the uh consolidated outland harbor bike thank you so much for watching i better go back inside the ship before my character freezes to death <laughs> so yeah ladies and gentlemen thank you so much for watching i'll see you guys next time